Hello everyone and welcome to today's video. This is another cool experiment that you can create at home with just a few simple things. So let's run through what we're going to make and what we need to make it. So what we're going to be making today is a balloon cup catapult. Now a catapult shoots things high and far and we're going to attempt to do the same thing with a cup and a balloon and of course we need something to catapult. So what we're going to be using today are these super cool coloured pom-poms. Now in order to do this you're going to need these things here on the table. We're going to need a pair of scissors so this means that you must be with a grown-up when we do this experiment to make sure that we're staying nice and safe. We're also going to need a balloon, any colour is fine, a cup, this is the main structure of our catapult, things to catapult, and then some sellotape. Now this is super easy to make everyone. So what we're going to do first is we're going to make the bottom part of our catapult. So all we need to do is towards the bottom of the cup, we're just going, and this is where you need a grown up by the way, we're going to pierce the cup carefully, just like that, and make a small hole. From here, we're going to cut all the way around the bottom of the cup. So we're going to cut the bottom completely away. And what that will leave us with is kind of like a tube. So keep cutting. And just be careful as you're doing it because scissors are very, very sharp. And there we have it. And it doesn't have to be perfect because this next part will correct all of that. So if you want to straighten out the edges of your cup, if you've done it a little bit messy like JJ has, that is what we end up with. Now next comes the balloon part. So take a regular sized balloon that you can get from most shops and again using our scissors we're going to cut just about here and we're going to take a little bit of the balloon off because we don't need to inflate this balloon we need to do something quite different with it. So if I cut that there like that there we go, so let's just put that over there and we are now done with our scissors. So what we've got there of course is the balloon part that you normally blow into and now we have a giant hole in the top and all we're going to do is stretch this over the cup. Yeah, so this might be the tricky part and you may need someone to help you do it. I should be able to do it just fine like that. Yeah. So now my balloon, and if I stretch out the cup just to make sure it's still nice and round, you should have something that looks a bit like that. Yeah. Now all we want to do is we want to secure the balloon to the cup using some tape. So all we're going to do now is just take a strip of tape, take our balloon and cup, and just lay some tape over it just like that and you want to do that around the whole cup so that the balloon doesn't come off when we're using it for our catapult it should keep it nice and firmly in place yeah and that is as simple as that there we go we have a balloon catapult now, I think the only thing left to do is test it out. So I'm going to put all of these coloured pom-poms in here. Now remember when you're using this catapult everyone, only use things that are soft and can't hurt anybody. And don't shoot this near anybody's face. And it might scare them or hurt them, so just be very careful with what we're putting into this catapult. Okay, so ready? We've got the soft pom-poms in there. And all you need to do to fire it is to pull the catapult back 
And... Wow, did you see that, everyone? Wow, that was amazing. Great stuff. Now, if you're going to be putting really small things in the catapult, you can tie a knot in the end of the balloon so that nothing else gets out. But you don't have to do that if you're using bigger things like pom-poms. Yeah. Now, I hope you had fun making this balloon catapult with me. Why don't you try it at home and see if you can make one? Yeah. And then see what you can fire around the room. I hope you had fun watching today, everyone. Do like and subscribe if you enjoyed the video. It helps us to bring you more videos like this. Take care, everybody, and I'll see you very soon.